morning guys happy monday welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel if you guys are new here if you are new here hi my name is maddie i make a lot of college content productive vlogs lifestyle vlogs all that good stuff so if you like that kind of content make sure you go subscribe down below it is 8 30 in the morning but it seriously looks like it's 8 30 at night right now <laughs> it's kind of thunderstorming and raining right now so it's so so dark outside and so dark in my room. I absolutely hate it. <laughs> you guys know I love my sunny mornings. So obviously we're vlogging today, but it's a little bit of a different vlog and I want to chat with you guys about it, but I do want to get ready first just because I feel so lazy like still being in sweats and stuff. So we're going to get ready first and then we'll chat. <laughs> Guys, there was some loud thunder just now and it's lightning and it's kind of pouring too so this is just what i'm wearing for now i am so sorry about the lighting it's gonna be really weird in today's video just because it is so rainy outside and i usually just don't film when it's raining because of the lighting but as you guys saw from the title it's kind of a big day i guess you could say but i just wanted to chat with you guys for a minute about it that was lightning. <laughs> this like never happens. Anyways, as you saw from the title, I am getting the COVID vaccine today, but I'm honestly like kind of hesitant to vlog today. I was kind of going back and forth between whether or not I wanted to just because the vaccine is kind of a controversial topic and people have very strong opinions about it. I don't know. I just kind of see my channel as a space where everyone can kind of get away from what's happening in the world right now i don't like to be very political on here i don't like to bring up controversial topics i don't want to draw negative people here but i was thinking about filming today and i just feel like i would regret it if i didn't i just want to document this moment for myself for the future or i don't know just kind of share my experience with you guys but with that being said the negative comments are not welcome here getting the vaccine is my own decision and I am not afraid to delete comments. I have that capability and I'm not afraid to use it. I will delete negative comments because this is ultimately my decision and that doesn't affect you. So leave me alone. By the time this is going up, I already did it. It's already done. I don't know. I just kind of felt like I needed to put a disclaimer on this video. <laughs> Here's the to-do list for the day. So today's Monday. Here's all the stuff that I have like time-wise today. So my vaccine appointment is at 12.30 and Doug and I scheduled ours for the same time. So we're gonna do a little cute vaccine date. <laughs> and then I have a class at 4.30 and then I am gonna go to the gym at six right after my class. And then as for stuff I need to do today, I need to film this vlog, obviously, upload a sponsorship for my Monday video. I have some homework, I need to respond to comments and respond to emails. I need to plan this week's content for like when I'm going to film what. And then I also have a Poshmark order to ship out, but there's only one, so not that big of a deal. And I also have to pick up a package at the leasing office. <music> want to put some potatoes in the oven they're just my normal roasted potatoes so i didn't film it but i'm just trying to make sure i eat stuff before i go so i don't feel like lightheaded or pass out or anything like that which i don't think i will i'm not like bad about needles and like getting shots and stuff so i think i should be fine please call 
and cancel your appointment if you have already received your COVID-19 vaccine. So I just got a call confirming my appointment and it said click one if you are confirming your appointment and if you're still coming and I did and it was just silence and they said there was an error so oh well. But it got so much brighter in my room. I love it. So I think it stopped thunderstorming. It might thunderstorm later in the afternoon but I'm just gonna wait on my potatoes, get some stuff done. I think right now I am gonna plan my content for this week and what I need to film and like when and all that stuff. So, but yeah, it's about an hour until I leave. So yeah, I'm excited. I'm not really nervous about like getting the actual vaccine. I'm just nervous about like where I'm supposed to go and where I'm supposed to park and like all that stuff. Okay, here are my beautiful potatoes. Okay, this is stupid, but here's my vaccine outfit. <laughs> I had to change out of the sweatshirt because I wouldn't have been able to pull my sleeve up far enough for them to like actually give me the shot. So I'm just gonna wear this. And I think it's still 50 degrees outside, so I'm just gonna wear this coat. My shirt is from Princess Polly. Still the same pink leggings and then tan Adidas. And I'm gonna wear my trusty cheetah print mask. So yeah, we're all good to go. I'm excited, a little nervous, but I'm sure it'll go great. <laughs> Okay, we made it to the vaccination place. We're in this really dark, creepy, like underground parking structure. And we just got says, here. please enter the building. Honestly, before we go in, I'm scared that Doug is gonna pass out because he's not good about needles. But we got here like half an hour early and we had to text the number to go into the building and Let's we're go. gonna go. Okay, bye. I just dropped Doug off. We went to Panera like you guys saw and we also ran into Meyer just to grab a few things. But I just wanted to sit and talk about my experience getting the vaccine and everything. I thought I would just sit in the car and chat with you guys before I went back into my apartment because I feel bad for always annoying my roommates with me talking all the time. And I also feel like I'm always just sitting in my room talking to you guys. So here's a little change of scenery. Honestly, I had a really good experience getting the vaccine. First of all, they were were really really organized which I appreciate because I had no clue where to go I'm not super familiar with the building I've been there a few times but I didn't know like what entrance to go in and everything but they had a ton of signs for parking right when you walked in they took your temperature they told you exactly where to go they gave you a sticker because there are two main entrances so the shamrock was like the parking structure and then they also had another little symbol um, sticker for the other entrance so that was all really nice. They told you exactly where to go. I had to fill out some paperwork and do like a little online fill out registration thing. I did make an appointment to get the vaccine that was required. Um, I got lucky and scheduled it this weekend for today. So I live in Michigan, by the way. So today was the first day that I was able to get the vaccine. This is like the first day that it's available to everyone over 18. I'm pretty sure just over 18 for now. But yeah, so we got really lucky with scheduling our appointments and getting it the very first day that they were available so yeah everyone that was working there and volunteering there so nice they were so helpful and just very welcoming which was very appreciated the nurse that we got was super nice they let Doug and I in like the same like vaccine little booth so we got our vaccine together as you guys saw in the clip and she was super nice I asked her if I could film and she was like yeah go for it and it was 
was super quick. I'm not kidding. The longest part was waiting the 15 minutes after you got the vaccine to see if you like had a reaction to it. And obviously Doug and I did not have reactions to it. We still feel perfectly fine. But the process was just so quick. It was so efficient. They knew exactly what they were doing. And it was just really nice to have everything go super quick. And parking was free. So that was cool. Obviously the vaccine was free too. But I don't know. I kind of expected to like pay for parking. And we luckily didn't have to. We both got Pfizer. And we have the second dose in three weeks. So we already scheduled that. So that's in three weeks. It's at the end of April. So yeah, that's all good to go. And I honestly don't have any complaints. But yeah, I just thought this would be kind of interesting to put in a vlog. This is kind of like a big moment. I feel totally fine. My arm is not sore. I'm kind of expecting it to get a little sore. Maybe like later tonight or tomorrow. But I got it in my left arm because I'm right-handed. So I figured my left arm doesn't do anything anyways. So let me know down below if you guys want me to vlog like the second dose. We still have a little ways to go until I get the second dose. But let me know if you guys want to see that whole process too. It was pretty easy to film. I was a little worried about like not being able to film if they would let me. I didn't really like film that much but I filmed as much as I could and it was honestly just a really fast process so there wasn't much I could film and I didn't want to give you guys all my personal info too when I was like filling out all this stuff so I filmed as much as I could so hopefully it was interesting to kind of see how everything was set up and see me get the shot and everything so oh I do have to go pick up a package at the leasing office though so I'm gonna go do that first and then I'll show you guys what I got because I think I know what it is but I don't know for sure um I don't want to show my address so that's why I'm covering that up but I ended up getting two different packages and they're both for for upcoming sponsorships so I'm not gonna show you guys this now you'll see it in a few videos later this month and here's a little Meyer haul not very interesting I needed more cartridge refills for my razor I had the flamingo razor where the razor part comes off and you just replace those instead of the entire razor I got a new mascara to try because mine's kind of drying out and I also got this shaving cream they didn't have the one that I normally use they were like very low on shaving cream options so I just got this one and it has coconut and oat flour in it but yeah that's literally everything I got not very interesting <laughs> Quick little shout out to all these amazing people who are always on top of my videos and watch them so quick. Thank you guys so much. I love you guys and I really appreciate all of your guys' support. In my world, I don't worry, darling. I just smile. Cause you're by my side now you're I have just under an hour before I have to log into class this is my news journalism class and it's just online so I don't need to like go anywhere so that's nice also I'm just now realizing that the lighting is messed up maybe that's better I don't know Maddie, how are you? I'm good how are you uh, very happy you're here thank you for asking Yes, there we are. Yes. Hi. <laughs> hello, hello. It's 5.45. I just got out of class. It was a really easy class today. It was mostly just like lecture stuff. Um, Update on my arm. It is pretty sore now. It's not like painful. It literally just feels like I did an arm workout and it's sore from that. I'm all good. It doesn't actually like painfully hurt. Other than that, I don't have any side effects or anything like that which I wasn't really expecting to have any so that's all good so yeah right now I'm going to change and get ready to go to the gym it's all sunny outside now so the weather's just being really weird it was supposed to rain a little bit more today but I guess not here's the gym outfit for today this is a like sports bra shirt type of thing from pink it's just like a long sports bra so you don't have to wear like a shirt with it which is really nice and then the matching black leggings tan adidas and my cute little vaccine band-aid <laughs> so we're gonna go get a workout in and just listen to some music do some intense walking on the treadmill <laughs> and i see it in yours too so now i sing to you and when you go leave me here all alone i'll be waiting you can't make it because i know after all this time, you'll read between these lines. Feeling fine, cause you're 
said this is all you want No more playing, playing, playing on all this Okay, I don't know why I forgot to film this, but I made a smoothie. It just has strawberries, raspberries, Nutella, and oat milk in it, and I haven't tried it yet, but it's a smoothie I make all the time, so it's probably really good. I look disgusting, but I am going to fix that. I'm going to take a shower really quick, so then I don't look disgusting anymore. I know you feel the same as I do. No more playing, wishing, waiting, and I was taking, 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 baby. Hi guys, so I just got out of the shower and I think I'm just going to end the vlog here. It's 8.33 right now and I don't know, I'm just pretty tired so I think I'm just going to lay in bed, catch up on some YouTube videos. I have so many YouTube videos in my subscription box to watch. I think I'm just gonna, you know, relax for the rest of the night and have another early morning and productive day tomorrow. We got a pretty decent amount of stuff done off of our to-do list. We didn't get everything done but that's okay. As for the update on my arm, it really just feels sore i didn't have any other side effects or anything like that so um if you guys have any questions i can try to answer those down below like i said i'm not a medical person i'm not a medical professional so i can only tell you guys what i know from my own experience but yeah let me know if you guys want to see a part two vlog to this but yeah i hope you guys enjoyed this vlog and seeing my experience and all that stuff um i don't really have anything else to update you guys on i didn't have anything crazy happen to me i feel totally fine my arm is just a little sore and that's Pretty much it so yeah thank you guys so so much for watching this video don't forget to subscribe and also follow me on all my social media links are down below but yeah that's going to be it for today's vlog thank you guys again for watching and i will see you guys very soon bye